my name is Sarah Bingley. And I'm Elizabeth Nakai. And we are the teachers of our four-year-old pre-K classroom. Welcome to our classroom where your child will be spending their day. We divide our classroom into centers. Each center focuses on different area of learning. We choose the materials and activities for each center very carefully to best meet the learning needs of our students. This is the Science Center, where our students can learn about the natural and physical world with hands-on activities. Each child has their own special cubby where they can put any artwork that they will take home at the end of the day, as well as anything else that needs to go home. This is our Writing Center, where students can practice using a variety of writing tools. They can draw pictures and practice writing numbers and letters. Here's our Math and Manipulative Center. Here we put out games and puzzles that help students learn numbers, colors, and shapes. We also provide building activities that help students develop fine motor skills and spatial awareness. This is our classroom library area where students can choose to look at books on their own or with a teacher. We also have story time every day when the teacher chooses a book to read to the whole class. We use this time to teach important reading and reading comprehension skills. The tables in this section of the classroom are used for meal times. We have breakfast and lunch and both a morning and afternoon snack in the classroom. These tables also part of our art center. We put out a variety of art materials that help encourage creativity and we use different tools like scissors, markers, and glue to help strengthen fine motor skills. These are the cots that we use for rest time. Each child has their own cot that they get to rest on every day after lunch. Our rest time is 30 minutes, but if a child is still awake after 15 minutes, we give them a book to read quietly until we turn the lights back on. The area of the classroom is where we have circle time and story time. Each child is assigned a different color spot to sit on. We use these large group learning times to teach a variety of skills like numbers, letters, shapes, social emotional skills, and much more. Here's the music center. Students can play an instrument, listen to music, and make up their own songs and dances. This is the block center where students can use their creativity to build a variety of structures. We also put out animals, people, and vehicles that our students can use to enhance their pretend play. Here is our dramatic play center. This is where a lot of pretend play happens. We have dolls, a kitchen, and all sorts of props. Throughout the year, we might add props to make a grocery store, a doctor's office, a space station, or anything else our students might be interested in. Young children learn a lot through role playing and trying out adult roles. We get to introduce a lot of vocabulary, writing, and communication skills in this center. We have a bathroom near our classroom that students can use nearly any time. We also have plenty of hand washing sinks that we'll be using often throughout our day. We hope that this video gives you a better idea of where your child will be during the day.